Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to On Track TV, and today we're going to be talking about Instagram. Now, usually Instagram is better if you're working from your cellular device, but today I'm going to talk about what you can do on Instagram from a desktop computer or a laptop. It is a little bit limited, you can't post any photos, but you can still check up on your notifications, the activity, and what's going on on Instagram. So let's dive in! All right, here we are on our Instagram on a computer. So the five main pages you have on Instagram is your newsfeed. So you have that on here. This is your newsfeed. You can scroll through it. All the photos show up and the likes and the comments that they have. The next button over you have, they're all reached here on the top, is your discovering page, which you also have on your iPhone. So this is where Instagram says, oh, I think you might know these people, follow their accounts. And you can click on their accounts and look at their accounts just like you can on your iPhone. The next button over is your notification page. It's a little drop down. It lets you know who's liking your photo, who's following you, all the activity that's going on that has to do with you. Just like on your iPhone, you can reach this. And you can also reach your profile just like you can on your iPhone. So this is my profile. It's sort of nice to look at your Instagram on a computer because it makes the photos very, very large. And when you hover over them, it gives a little information. So this photo has 39 likes with the heart and zero comments with a little speech bubble. And when you hover over every single photo, it gives you that brief little information about it. And you can then also click on the photo and it will show you how many likes, allow you to add a comment. This looks great. I just commented on my own photo. It shows the caption, it shows the location, and it shows my name. So very similar to the iPhone, you can um, stalk people still. So into the search bar up here, just like you have on your iPhone, you can search in anything. Let's say I search in Lulu Burin, and her account shows up. She's a private account, so you can't see it. But you could also search one of your friends. So if I search someone I was following, their profile shows up, and it looks really cool when it's not on an iPhone. It's actually on Instagram, and it's so big in HD. So the only difference between your computer and your iPhone is you can't upload a photo. So you still have your news feed, you still have your explore discovering page, you still have your notifications, and you still have your profile. You have four out of the five main pages of Instagram. I made a video what it's like on your iPhone, so the only difference that it is for your computer, as you can see, we're on a computer on the internet, is you can't upload a photo. So you'd have to use a cellular device to do that. Thank you so much for tuning in today on our Instagram series and stay tuned for some more videos and some tips and tricks and trick and trick and trick.